So Raven's piece is beautiful overall. The process was definitely difficult. Being that we're so involved here as dance majors and then set aside trying to do these senior shows is a little complicated, but overall we found a way to meet and work it out. Um, you know, we come into rehearsals. Raven kind of, she started out telling us what her idea was behind, uh, behind her piece, behind her choreography, what uh, she wanted to convey uh, to the audience, things like that. And we started lear learning the choreography step by step. I'm Raven Jelks, and I'm the choreographer for Outrospect. And Outrospect's been a fun show to put together. Um, basically, I came into this with the intention of just making a show about everyday people and the things that everybody goes through. And so it's got humor, it's got, you know, sad stuff, heart, you know, all of the everyday things that everybody experiences. And it's my take on that, thus the whole outrospect thing. It's one person's take on everything else that everybody goes through. Outrospect is a wonderful show. I think everybody should come out and see it because there are different pieces in different parts of the show that you wouldn't expect to see in this performance. So overall, all the hard work pays off and you'll enjoy it. Everybody should come see Outrospect because each piece has something special that makes it unique and makes it really appealing for the eye and for the audience to watch and there's never a dull moment and it's really, it's just a collaboration of awesome choreography and creativity. It's wonderful. We're gonna run around and bump each other like popcorn and you won't see that anywhere else except in Raven's show. It's a really, really diverse show which is fun to do because you walk into rehearsal and you it's something different every single time. Uh, I'd say the audience should be excited because there is a great group of dancers here, um, you know, that Raven's working with that all love what they do and they come in and they give it their all and they just love working with her and they, I, th I think they do a great job. <laughs> basically sets out a schedule in the beginning of the week and would make sure we all can come. And we come once a week, knock it out, learn the choreography, tape it, and then we have the rest of the week to remember it, rehearse it. And then the next week we'll usually do it with music and set it and do spacing and fix details. And it's been a super easy process. I think she has to be one of the most easy choreographers I worked with. She knows what she wants to do and we got the dance done very quickly. Yeah, so she took pictures of us individually. Um, she made us, we were basically ourselves in front of the camera, we were just doing little gestures. And from there, she choreographed based on those images that she took. Expect to see us be ourselves on stage. Um, I would say I'm excited for, you know, doing this show because I finally get to express myself after being here for four years. Um, it's something I never expected doing at all. Um, seeing all the other senior shows over the years and then thinking, oh, I'm just gonna dance, I'm not ever gonna have to choreograph. And then it kind of just came in my head, I think last year, junior year, and I was like, you know what, this is, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna, it's, I'm gonna challenge myself and then bam, here it is. <laughs> And there was a part in rehearsal with Andy that um, he, he looked like he was thinking of a movement or of a way to get into and out of a piece or a section. And I just said, why don't we retrograde it? And he goes, yeah, totally. Like, and, we, and that's in the piece. And now it's called the retrograde part, you know? So, and he's, he's so open to working with people. Like <laughs> working with Andy is always a blast. Um, Having him as a choreographer was really awesome. Whenever we needed to see if something worked or something didn't, like he always asked us, are you comfortable? Like, does this work for you? It's throughout, in the beginning, it's more dark. Um, there's more of a mystery to it. Um, and as the show progresses, um, it becomes lighter towards the end to bring it to like a close and just to see the progression 
throughout the dance is really nice to see. Being at Adelphi, it's the one uh, piece that I've been in that a guy's choreographed and made a whole show out of it. So it's, I love to get into the other, like, the other person's mind, like not so much of a girl's mind. Or I just like to see what's going on in, in a boy's mind with dance. There's just a lot of variety of movements and feelings going on that the audience can interpret for themselves. It's just pure entertainment. Where, yeah. And it's also, we put a lot of work and a lot of hours into this that I think it deserves an audience and I think everyone's going to enjoy it. Mm -hmm. On May 16th, come out and see Raven Jelts, Outrospect, and Andy Jacobs in your mind.